this begins our little adventure off to the north here over to Mount Baker for a couple days for work in the scoop I've brought a lot of stuff with me it'll just be a nice little cruise we're gonna have a good time yeah buddy we're finally on the road I had to turn back like twice because man I have been uh, fumbling all day I guess here we go freeway mode and get that little it's very yellow right now it's actually on the bad side but we're gonna probably have to get the semi bro we should probably just get moving i always like this section of i-5 because it kind of reminds me of like arizona freeways Alrighty, passing through Tacoma here going north to seattle look at the mountain range right there holy shit, dude that looks amazing the honey bucket guy. Hell yeah. Dude. Tacoma Dome. Uh oh. That thing looks sick. I'm not gonna lie. Yo, look at that mountain, bro. That's crazy. Montana plates. What you doing in my state, boy? Holy shit, this man's is moving. He's coming up on the left. Is it a Camry? Hold on. That was the sign on TC. That's crazy. Little fender flare scoop action. Yo, this dude got the whole Insta360 out here. Adventure! Ew. Nice. I got the other one. The Insta360's brother. Little brother. Half. Half brother. Slow traffic ahead. Oh no. Here we go. There's Seattle. Oh, by the graces of God, does that, uh... I think I see it. I think it's green down there. I think it says express lanes open. Yes, green. I see green. Also, Seattle, hello. I'm in you now. I like the express lanes, they're kind of nice. This guy is going very slow. Are you trying to get out of here or are you trying to like, what are you doing? Should I trust and just go straight through or should I go express lanes? There must be a reason the express lanes are open, right? Usually I just send it on the express lanes. So I think I'm gonna do that today. We'll see if our luck prevails. Cause this usually, this is a bad indicator because this goes really fast and then it gets down to there and it's really slow. So I'm going to go express lanes because I don't need to stop in Seattle at all. Let's get into the tunnels we go, rat sewer. Sewer rat.
this will be the spot. I'm gonna pull over right up here because it looks pretty incredible over here. Probably just right here would be good. Look at that perfect parking spot. Man, all right, I'm gonna shut it. I shut it off for a second. Take a look. Man, she pretty today. Whoo! And that like crazy wispiness of the. Wow. Take my little video. Yeah, man. Oh, yeah, take that in, man. Woo! And then that hard cut of the clouds in the sun. That looks crazy. Also, there's that McLaren that we saw earlier. They're actually just now coming up. So that's pretty sick. Check it out. There she is. And there's the beamers that were kind of along with them. So, yeah. Bada bing, bada boom. I think I'm okay here. Yo, it's been uh, super cold today. It's 44 degrees out right now. I have it set at 64 and it's heating my car right now, which is crazy. But check out the view of the mountain. It's just peeking up up there. I would take you guys uh, a little bit over to the top there because it looks like it's clearing up right now, which is perfect for what we want. Oh shit, I didn't bring the camera. Let me go. I gotta run back down real quick and grab the camera because I feel like we're gonna get some epic shots here in a few minutes. I love it out here, bro. This is one of the more epic spots to be. Look at that, it's gonna be sick. Uh, we, we definitely need a camera for this. All right, here we go again. I got the, I got the thing. The camera's right there. The hill climb begins. Let's pull down some of these windows so you guys can see a little better. Oh, so exciting. Oh, yep, yeah, we go all the way up that. Oh! oh, these corners are tight, bro. I love it. This thing planted, handles well. The only thing is it's a little slick out today and obviously really foggy too. So hoping we can uh, find some stuff up here though. I'm probably gonna miss out on- Oh my God, dude! Holy shit! How do I get there? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, dog! No way! <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, that's sketchy. Don't do that. And don't fall off that, but... Oh, the colors. Oh, the fogginess, too. I love that so much. This is like my favorite view. How can you not like that? I'm gonna try to do like a, a panoramic shot there. Maybe I can get a shot of the, the Subaru. Oh yeah, baby. That's right. That's what I'm talking about. Alrighty, let's continue on our journey. I really, one of my favorite things about this area is all the reds and oranges that come out mixed in with all the greens. Oh my gosh, burning clouds. This is insane. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh man, and Scott Hill Assist, hell yeah, brother. All right, let's go. Oh, I gotta put on my seatbelt. He's yelling at me already. Yeah, we gotta get up. We gotta go up. All right, so this ain't looking too hot right this second. It looks like an abyss of nothingness. So I'm just gonna turn around because I don't think there's any point of going to like Artist Point per se, but this is close enough. But this is what it looks like here right now. Literally a rock wall stuck between a wall and a not hard place. Let's brighten it up a little bit. Get that, get that. Okay, well that's pretty much it. I have no hopes for up there unless we break cloud line, which I don't think we're going to. So let's just go all the way back down, I guess. Yeah, that's what I wanted to see. All right. We'll take this spot then. I'll take a pull off here. Yeah, because you can kind of see like all the lakes and stuff chained in here. I'll get a photo of that. Get a couple stops down. Get like a decent one. 
and I really like the reds, so I kind of want to shoot from over here. Actually, yeah, because you can see the reflection or a little bit of like that sheen from the water. I was down there yesterday. That was a pretty cool spot too. Oh, that! Look at that. That's beautiful. Boom, boom. It is chilly, but it's so worth it. Oh man, what a great place to be. I forgot you were actually able to like park here at one point. It looks like half the road fell out. This is the view I was trying to go for though. Ah, I don't know. It's too good. All of it's good. Here comes the sun. Doo 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 doo. Or I'd like to say that, but I think it's disappearing on us. But it's brightening up right there. So maybe it's just like <laughs> slice through real quick. I like the little jaggedness of the peaks. Oh my god, oh the fucking, ah, it's too good, it's too good. Okay, sweet. A little freaking house too. All right, we gotta make it, boom. Okay. Go for a little adventure. That's a sick little staircase. Little picnic with the view. Crazy, hold on. Hit him with it. Yo. The colors are just so magical this time of year. It's really like nothing else, huh? Yo, this is what I was looking for. Wow, we're gonna get into thousand ISO territory. That's crazy. At 1 40th of a second. It's because I have the polarizer on, but I don't really like taking it off. So it gets that richness of color, I think. Yeah. Wild. Get my freaking camera going here. Too bad we can't just stay for the duration, but I am hungry and I need to eat because the next thing I'm gonna eat is tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. So that's another 12 hours. I had lunch at noon, so it's been a long day already. This is the Pacific Northwest magic right here, dude. This is crazy. This is when you drive your Subaru through the mountains type Pacific Northwest right now, right here, bro. Okay, let's see. Oh, wedding photos. That's gorgeous. Hell yeah. So it turns out that today is a lovely day out here on Mount Baker. Um, yeah, the sun's starting to poke through. The clouds are kind of burning off a little bit. We're marking out fifth of a mile stretches that we're gonna be using for some tree cutting stuff. We're doing a tree cutting course, basically. All right, we have an out, I think. I think we can get off the mountain now, potentially. We might have to wait for a second because they're clearing trees. You can see all this dust and dirt on the bottom. Yeah, that's all from bark and trees. Yeah, they're being kind of stingy about letting us out. There's just one of the loaders, got the big trees in here. God, holy shit. They've been putting down trees. Here we go. They're letting us out, finally. Sweet Jesus. <clears throat> Thank you. Oh, these little tree canopies are like my favorite thing to drive through because you got the light filtering through it. You got the curvy ass road. Oh, it's so good. Well, looks like we are, um, there's a lot of traffic going home right now. And we're in Bellingham already, so we might as well just take advantage of this nice, lovely, lovely day. And hit Chuck on a drive real quick and maybe stop along the way, eat some food, do that old thing. Uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. I'm just gonna take a little cruise down to our normal viewpoint that we like and uh, hang out there, eat my box lunch. I forgot to turn you guys on. There we go. Box lunch. Him? Nice. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. Well, shoot. That ain't too bad, is it? Got a hammock. Got my lunch. Got the scoob right there. And got crazy view. I love coming out here. Got my little carrots. Just hang out for a little bit. Really can't beat that, man. Man, I used to come out here all the time. <laughs> 